this is Gallon Gamer here, and welcome to Spin Tires. This time, sadly, not on the old Telegraph track because um, it broke. Frankly, the map broke. So what what I'll be doing is I'll I'll be playing the river, and instead of this instead of the car, I'm going to take something that's a bit challenging because you know I need a good challenge. Something like one of these big trucks is way too overpowered. And I have experienced the little Toyota here. You saw that in my last episode of Spin Tires. That didn't go well. Well, it did go well because it was insane. Because I drove another car behind it and it was frankly not good. So I will just be, I guess, taking the UAZ 2206 because that's a thing that's good. I could, I could also take the B130. Nah, we've seen that too many times. On this thing goes. I'm going to go for a casual and let's go. Let's see if I still remember the buttons from last time. Oh, okay. Um, wheels. I like these. Um, garage parts. Oh god, that's a trailer. This gets me one garage point. This is a total of two garage points. So I shall take this. And my goodness. Uh, parking brake was... No, not that one. Nope. Um, there it is. This should be my all driving diff look. There we go, exactly. Um, well, all driving diff look on, and off we go, I guess. Oh, boy. oh god, that was weird. Um, now I'm going to stop right here and map. Nope. More camera buttons. More camera buttons. Where's my map? No, that. There's my map. So, um. Now I guess we could go get the B130. And there's our objective. But the garage is here, so I'll be kind of going right here. I'll make myself a little path. Then, um. Well. Up here, and then right there. So we kind of go like this. Should do. And, well, let's just go. Although, is there a quicker? No, you could only cut through the forest, but I'm not doing that. I am doing that. Because I might be a little bit insane, I'm going to be doing that. Are we on trailer cam? I think we're on trailer cam. Camera, there we go. That's the right camera. Dangerous water level? Yeah, right. Now. I think I just have to... If I go this way, that will get me... The perfect direction for the garage. Ouch, that hurt. Real bad. I will now be proceeding with caution. Actually, caution to the wind. Only in spots where it gets kind of dangerous, like right here, I would be. But then accelerating out again. Yeah, full throttle. And are we stuck? Because I don't want to winch yet. And no, we aren't stuck. That's good. But it's real nice that we have back roads. It's real nice. How far are we? Um. Well, that's a tree right there. Also, I do not have any repair points, which means if I do beans it up, or, well. Okay, bit of road there. That seems to lead nowhere. I see, I see path. I see path. 
and right through. That's some rocks right there. How's it looking? It's looking fine now just to remove that and take a lift because that went that went really quickly. Oh but this this is some deep slop. This is some deep slop right here. Oh yeah, this is deep. But wiggling always gets you out. At least most of the time always. Sometimes you're just Okay, automatic transmission, what were you doing there? Yeah, I'm just leaving it in auto because I... Oh god. That's a lot of mud. I could now also... I will try going through the deep end of the forest. Now. Just to... Go a little bit on the throttle, just a little bit. Because that, yeah. Then they grip up because spinning gets you nowhere. Though I can't leave it in, in new, oh, not neutral, in idle. Okay, now. Oh, oh, this is this is deep. I'm going to be winching. About that, uh, nope, wrong button. Power and winch button. I don't know what the winch button is, so I'm just holding F on my keyboard. F to pay respects. Actually, we don't need to pay respects yet. Nothing has fallen over. Um, I think I can turn that off. Tree. Oh, look, a little cozy cottage. How are we doing? Are doing well? I'm going to go around the big obvious pit. At least I'm going to try to. That's a tree. Who thought the forest was this kind of. Oh god, that was close. This kind of racetrack. Because I'm just in basically what's one wheel drive. Um, how are we doing now? Um, I'd like to go right this way. Yeah, if I, if I was to go straight here, that would get me to the garage. Now, just be careful not to get into any mud, because that slows you down. Oh god, she's sliding, she's sliding. All wheel drive. Go on, go on. I'll drive off. I see it. I see the garage. Um, what's the button to shift? Isn't that one? There it is. Um, nope, not reverse, please. I'd like to go for basically um, low three. And let her bite right through. Yeah, let her bite. Oh, she's going. Yeah. She is eaten up. Well, that's done. Back into auto box. All wheel drive and diff lock off. And let's go. Let's see some speed up in here. And that's the next mud patch. Can I kind of go around the out? Nope, I can't. And there she is. There is the garage. Uh, parking brake? Uh, was it this button? Yeah, it was. And unloaded. This thing is now bone stock. So, um,. Let's try, well, let's see what this thing has. Salty attachment. Garage tools cart, spare wheel. 
Hmm. I am not sure. Because this thing is frankly terrible. I'd have to make two trips. So what I think I'll do... Hmm. This thing is virtually useless. You know what? I'll be right back after a magic jump cut to when I have the B-130. So I'll just do a... And I'm back. I now have the B-130, which is just rear-wheel drive and diff lock. But it can carry two garage points, so I'm taking the challenge. I am taking the challenge of basically just flooring it and hoping it makes it through the mud. Also, I left the B-66, I think, was it? I just left that where I found this thing. Yeah, it is struggling. Because it's a 2x6, I think. But who cares? Because I will make it over there. I will make it to the garage in this video. Come on. Now, I have sped this section of the video up because um, it was basically a winch fest. But, now, um, you might be seeing some VR footage from me soon, maybe, because we are still getting um, an Oculus Rift S. Yeah, and yeah, you see on this footage it's literally just a winch fest. So I think you can get already get excited for games like Job Simulator and or some VR racing games like Dirt Rally and other stuff which I haven't decided on yet. So um, I guess just continue with the time lapse until it's done. I shouldn't have stopped because that killed all of my momentum. Okay, now just go on a bit further, and we have the garage unlocked, and that will be the end of the video. But that's not there, we're not there yet, so yeah, so this is you will be seeing more of this. I will be completing this map hopefully if spin tires doesn't crash and decide to ruin my save game but that is a story for another time but it appears my controller is somewhat broken because um only the left um how do i say this without being weird the left kind of rotor that makes it vibrate um, only works. The right one is dead, I think. So that's a thing. And now straight through the mud. Please go. I should have picked better vehicles for this. I should have. Something like the Land Cruiser, but that would have been cheating because those things are frankly overpowered. And this thing is frankly underpowered. So let's just hook to that tree. Uh, no, not that one. This one. And I have towed myself out again, so I'll hook that. And I can see the garage lights. Like, I thought I unhooked that. This game sometimes. Now, I see the UAZ or UAZ. 
how please tell me in the comments how to pronounce that is it UAZ or UAZ I have no idea but I'm guessing it's UAZ because it, it's VAZ and GAZ and stuff and LADA not L-A-D-A -A. so go on There we go. V130, I'm never going to be using you again. Ever. So, here we are. At the garage, carrying my garage points. Maybe it would have been clever to hold, load down the back. Here we go. That's this garage unlocked. So, thank you all for watching. That was it. Do not forget to tune in next time for more Spin Towers. Or some VR game. But until then, thank you for watching. And bye bye